Greetings and good tidings to you. Prime Minister Winston Churchill said in the 40s, There come a time in the life of a man when destiny taps one at the shoulder to perform a duty that he was born to perform. What a tragedy when that moment comes to find one unprepared. I declare you be prepared. At your Kairos moment, you'll be ready. Under the spiritual covering of His Eminence, Archbishop Nicholas Duncan Williams, Bishop Mike Songiso has been mandated to empower your destiny. If you're in Windhoek, Namibia, come and fellowship with us in our ministry, Destiny Empowerment Center. Our mission is to bring souls into the kingdom of God. We have a mission to empower you. Greetings, beloved. It's time for Unlocking Destines with Bishop Mike. Thank you for joining me tonight. I don't know what time it is in the part of your world, but whatever it is, I bring you greetings in the mighty name of Jesus. Thank you for joining us. Please take time to share this broadcast. Invite your friends. Let them know that Bishop Mike is live on the program Unlocking Destines. And indeed, something will be unlocked in your life today in the name of Jesus. The psalmist says, I was glad, very glad, when they said to me, let us go to the house of the Lord. Hallelujah. You may not be in physical, physically, you may not physically be in church right now, but wherever you are, I believe we are going to have church tonight, and it's going to be awesome in the mighty name of Jesus. Jesus said, where two or three are gathered in my name, I am there in their midst. So I want to rest assured that uh, though we may not be together physically, but we know there is no distance in prayer. And today, we shall encounter the mighty God. He is a faithful God. The other time we're sharing, we're saying, the Lord your God in your midst is mighty to save. He sings it over you. He showers us with joy in the name of Jesus. We serve an able God. He is able to do exceedingly, abundantly, far above we can ask Him or even beyond our imagination. We serve a mighty God. He is the El Gibo. He is the El Shaddai. He is the all-powerful. He is a powerful God. Our God is bigger than the storms. He's bigger than the valleys we may be facing or we may be going through right now. Hallelujah. Praise be to God. Today I want to encourage us from the book of Psalms. To them from the book of Psalms as we'll be praying, taking time to pray. In the book of Psalms 34, verse 19, the Bible says, Many are the afflictions of the righteous, but the Lord delivers him out of them all. Hallelujah. When we talk about faith, we are not saying we are ignoring the fact that we are going through things. We are aware we are going through stuff. That's the reason why we run to God. The Bible says the name of the Lord is a strong tower. The righteous run to it and they are safe. Many are the afflictions of the righteous. Meaning as a child of God, you may be going through a lot of tough times. But one thing you and I are encouraged is that you know, it doesn't matter how many difficulties we may be facing, but the Lord will deliver us in the name of Jesus. The very God that delivered Daniel from the den of lions is able to deliver you out of that pit of death in the name of Jesus. He's able to deliver you out of, I don't know, wherever you find yourself, an addiction or whatever it is bondage you find yourself in, our God is able to deliver you out of that. Some of us, it's a habit and you have been asking God, Lord, how do I come out of this? As we pray tonight, you will come out. That addiction will break in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Many are the affliction. Many are those things that trouble us as children of God. But the Lord has assured us of one thing. He's going to deliver us. So wherever you are, I want you to charge yourself in your most holy faith. I want you to be expectant as we pray. I want to pray along. Connect in the Holy Ghost with us here in the name of Jesus. The Bible also says in the same book of Psalms 34 in verse 17, the Bible says, The righteous cry and the Lord heareth and delivers them out of all their troubles. So as a child of God, from time to time, after many times, we go through troublous situations, uh, difficult situations. But the Lord has assured, when we cry to Him, 
when we pray to him he has assured us in verse 17 that he will deliver us i don't know what you're going through child of god some of us could be in an abusive relationship today as we pray may the lord deliver you from that abusive relationship that abusive marriage whatever it is may the lord deliver you today we are going to pray listen we are not a people that are without hope we're a people that have hope the bible says uh, they looked up to him their faces were radiant and were not ashamed we know where we draw our strength from we know where we get well, what is charges ourselves to have faith and hope for tomorrow we know who to run to in a difficult moment we serve a mighty god some trust in chariots some trust in horses but we put our trust in the name of the lord jesus christ who is the same yesterday today and forevermore so wherever you are child of god we are going to take time to pray as we'll be praying here and there i'll uh, take time to pray for some of them through some messages that you've been sending me some of you that as you are sending now will be taking time to pray in the name of jesus hallelujah the first thing i want us to pray for is for god to give us victory over every affliction we are facing right now some of us is an affliction in your body it's a medical situation it's a medical condition whatever it is our god is jehovah rapha the bible says is there no balm in gilead in jeremiah 8 verse 22 is there no balm in gilead is there no physician we know who our physician is his name is jesus we know by the straps of jesus we are healed hallelujah we know what our confidence in god will always yield results hallelujah is it an affliction is it your career some of us we have studied you've got your degree you've got a diploma you've got your master i don't know what you've been studying but you cannot get a job you cannot establish a channel of consistent income in your life today we'll pray in the name of jesus he is a faithful god there's listen to me the same ear that god used to answer the prayer of hannah is the same ear he's going to lend to you and he will answer in the name of jesus some of us as we prepare to pray we may have to promise god like hannah i'm, I'm being inspired to go this route hannah said lord if you give me a child i will dedicate this child to you some of us god has just been waiting for us to make a vow lord if you give me this job i will stand with my man a woman or woman of god i'll finance the work of the church some of us god has just been waiting for us to make that vow is that is you when god blesses you be quick to fulfill your, your vow be quick to honor your vow be quick to see that you keep your bargain in the name of jesus hallelujah i believe i just spoke to someone prophetically right there some of you are trusting god for a job in psalms 80 verse number eight psalms 80 verse number eight the bible says lord you have taken a vine out of egypt you have planted it you have caused it to take deep roots for you your egypt might be unemployment may the lord pluck you out of egypt that unemployment may he establish you in the name of jesus today we are praying many are the affliction of the righteous but the lord delivers them out of them or wherever you are call upon the name of the lord call upon the name of the lord let me see your comments but drop your comments we want to see what you're trusting god for if it is confidential slide in a message in my inbox or through the email that you are going to give in the contact details later on we are praying wherever you are do not die in silence we are here to stand with you in the name of jesus would you call upon the name of the lord wherever you are whoever shall call upon the name of the lord shall be saved begin to pray rakase tebo shata makoro bosha rabaka zotode ratoto tata ratote tete 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 let there be a turning around let there be a turning around makura basa kadada ribaka baba 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 many are the afflictions of the righteous you deliver them out of them all in the name of jesus in the name of jesus mando robo satanda baba baba ribaka zete de 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 mando robo sete de 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 ramama baba 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 ramande de 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 baba 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 against frustration i come against frustration in the name of jesus 
in the name of Jesus. I come against frustration from the pit of hell. I release the life of God, the life of God, the life of God. I release healing, healing in the name of the curse of God, in the name of Jesus. At the mention of the name of Jesus, every knee shall bow and confess that Jesus is Lord. HIV AIDS, I command you to bow and confess that Jesus is Lord. My grain, go in the name of Jesus. My grain, go in the name of Jesus. My grain, go in the name of Jesus. I pray for everyone that is uh, that is attested uh, positive for the coronavirus. I command healing in the name of Jesus. I command healing. I command a favorable result in the name of Jesus. Today, we lift you before the throne of grace in the name of Jesus. Marikosia, Marika Komanga Rabaka Zoto, Ribaka Zoto Rabaka Te, Rita Toro Mosetea, Visitation, a time of visitation, Deliverance, 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 Rakatu, Ramande Mosetea, we release grace with intervention, may the Lord intervene, may the Lord intervene, may the Lord rescue you, Karibo Seto Rabababa, Rita, the wonder in your life, a wonder in your life, a wonder in your life, Ribaka Zoto Rababa, Rakatatata, Ramandurubo Sete, Rabako Sotoya, in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, Manderebo Sete, that ailment, let it go, let that wound, let it dry up, let it dry up, let it dry up, I call for that miracle job, I call it forth, in the name of Jesus, I pray for those ideas, I, I stretch my hand as a point of contact, I decree, I declare, those business plans shall take off, in the name of Jesus, I call for financing of the projects, of the plans, in the name of Jesus, I call for financiers, in the name of Jesus, I call for financing of those plans, in the name of Jesus, Marakotoya, Rakatetea, Ribakasetea, Ikanderebea, they that desire guidance, direction, they don't know which way to go, which way to take, I speak guidance in the name of Jesus, may the Lord order your footsteps, may the Lord guide you today, in the name of Jesus, Kaliba Sataya, you will complete what you have started, you will complete in the name of Jesus, I pray for the students, you will excel, you will do well, you will graduate, you will complete, you will do well in the name of Jesus, you shall not drop out on the way, in the name of Jesus, I pray for the learners, I pray for the students, the grace for excellence, the wisdom for excellence, the wisdom to excel, the wisdom to do well, the grace to perform well, in the name of Jesus, I present all your ideas, your plans, before the throne of God, breathe of God, breathe upon them, breathe upon them, in the name of Jesus, the breath of God, the breath of God, the breath of God, the breath of God, Marakatea, Ramandurubosaya, Ramandurubosaya, Hallelujah, Ratata, Hallelujah, Hallelujah, be glorified Yahweh. I'm making reference to the inbox messages. Some of them I'll just select a few randomly or as the, uh, the, uh, my eyes could, can see. This message came someone that is saying, I'm often frustrated and no, uh, there's no one to talk to. Yes. And I keep going back to drinking. And I wake up regretting. I, it's draining my spiritual life. This basically you are talking about is you're having a problem of drunkenness. You keep going back to drinking. You tell yourself, I want to stop this. You are reminding me of what the Apostle Paul in the book of, uh, I believe, Romans 7, verse 25 says, the things that I want to do, I end up not doing. And that thing that I don't want to, uh, I don't want to do, I end up doing, and vice versa. 
whatever addiction, whatever uh, oppression of the enemy are going through today, we break that addiction. Not only are we praying for you, but everyone that is in this category, where they keep on doing things that they don't want to do, today we break that addiction uh, in the name of Jesus. We break that addiction, uh, that nicotine uh, spirit in the name of Jesus. Uh, where you keep on smoking, uh, where you're hooked on two drugs, uh, where you're bound to drinking, uh, today I stand as a servant of God. Uh, foul speed, go in the name of Jesus. Uh, I decree, I declare those desires to go in the name of Jesus. Uh, I speak a hunger, a thirst uh, for the things of the spirit uh, and longing for the deeper things of God in the name of Jesus. Every addiction bow in the name of Jesus uh, at the mention of the name of Jesus. Uh, bow in the name of Jesus. Kariba Kazetea. Receive your miracle. Receive your miracle. Receive your visitation. Receive your miracle. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Mayakotoya. Hallelujah. 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 I see some of you have sent me messages with pictures of your loved ones, quite a number of you. But all in all, you are in the category of healing. We release healing. We already prayed for healing. Just receive your miracle. Listen to me. Some of you, you are standing in for your loved ones. Go and lay your hands upon them. The Bible says, as believers, in the book of Mark 16, the Bible, Jesus says, go and lay hands upon the sick and they shall recover. As we have prayed, as we are agreeing with you, just go and lay hands. If you don't know what to pray, just declare you are healed in Jesus' name. That's all. We shall hear testimonies in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Some of you are praying for jobs. I've seen your messages. I've seen your, I've, I've been, I'm not ignoring you. We already prayed for you to receive uh, that miracle, that wonder job from above. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Quite a number of messages that will continue praying with the team of intercessors here. As we prepare to close this broadcast, I want to pray one prayer. Lord, perform a wonder in my life. Perform a wonder in my life. Mary was not expecting a wonder to be the mother of baby Jesus, but God surprised him. Hallelujah. Some of you, you are going to pray as you ask God to perform a wonder. Is give me a skill. Open my eyes to see the talent, that ability you have given me that I'm not even aware of. Open my eyes that I may see what is locked on my inside. Wherever you are, I want to pray one prayer. Lord, in this season, in this year, perform a wonder in my life. Go ahead and pray in the name of Jesus. Father, in the name of Jesus, as we close this broadcast, I pray for your loved ones, wherever they are, let there be a wonder. Let there be a wonder. Let there be a wonder. A wonder, oh God, in the morning, in the afternoon, in the evening. Let there be a wonder. 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 Perform a wonder. Perform a wonder. Perform a wonder. Rakatote te de 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 ya. Ramandere bosi ya. Mandere bosi ya. Mandere bosi te de. Mandere bosata. Rata ta 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 ta. A wonder in the name of Jesus. A wonder in the name of Jesus. A wonder in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. I believe it is done. He is turning it in your favor. Deliverance. He is turning it in your favor. He is turning it in your favor in the name of Jesus. A wonder. 
Rakasete. Yandidebosha. I'm waiting to hear your testimony. I'm looking forward to reading your testimony. I'm looking forward to hearing what God is doing in your life. Victory. He's turning it in your favor. Everything is working out for your good. You are the next person to testify. You are the next person to glorify God. You are the next person to dance and you dance for Jesus. You are about to see the goodness of God in the land of the living. In your place of shame, God is turning it for your good. In the name of Jesus. Turning it in your favor. Turning in your favor. The Lord has not abandoned you. The Lord has not forsaken you. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. He is turning it in your favor. He is turning it in your favor. Yes. The tables are turning in your favor. May the Lord bless you till we come your way again. He is turning it for your good. He is turning it in your favor. Hallelujah. Your mouth shall be filled with laughter. The Lord is singing a song over you. In the mighty name of Jesus. May the Lord bless you. May the Lord keep you. May the Lord increase you. I pray for a wonder in your life. That unexpected wonder. In Jesus precious name. The Lord bless you. Shalom. 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 Contact us on phone at plus 264-81214-3300. Email info at destinyempowermentcenter.com or visit our website at www.destinyempowermentcenter.com. Destiny Empowerment Center, making global generational impact.